So you hire a window cleaning company and they clean your windows, they look great, but now you're wondering, well, how often should I maintain them? And that's a question I get asked by clients numerous times. On what schedule should I get my windows maintained? It really depends on two things. One, your budget, and two, how much do you care about your windows? An average house has thousands of dollars of glass. And so you wanna protect that glass. If you don't clean the windows on a regular basis, you could have problems such as corrosion, especially from hard water. A lot of times what hard water will do is it will put etches into your glass, meaning it burns holes into your glass. And the way to prevent that is to have them cleaned on a regular basis. People ask me how often they should have it cleaned. I would recommend at least every three months. If you don't wanna do it every three months, I would have the outside windows cleaned at least every six months, and then have the inside and out of all of your glass done once a year. I highly recommend that, and that will keep your glass looking great, and it should keep it corrosion free for years to come. So a window cleaning company comes over, washes your window, they look sparkling clean, but then you need your screens cleaned. Well, you can either have them clean the screens for you, or you can do it yourself, and let me give you some tips on how to clean your screens. First off, let me tell you what not to do. Don't power wash your screens. If you power wash your screens, you're going to have problems. You're going to have marks that go back and forth on the screens, and that's from the power washer. Worse, it could ruin your screen completely and rip holes into it. You do not want to power wash your screens. If you wash them with soap and water, they would look all right. But a lot of times, you do have muddy spots and you do have muddy streaks on it. It doesn't get them the way you want them to turn out because they're so dirty. The best way to clean a screen, you need a soft bristle brush that is that is firm. You can get it at your local hardware store. If you, if you brush them and you start from the corners, you'll be able to get the screen looking really nice. You, wash, you, you, you brush both sides of the screen, and if you want to further protect your screens after cleaning them, I recommend highly 303 Protectant. You can find that online. You could use Armor All, but it doesn't work as well. And it's so important that you do keep up your screens. And again, if this is too much of a hassle to do that yourself, I highly recommend you hire a window cleaning company uh, to do that for you so you don't have to worry about it. So you hire a window cleaning company, they come over, but someone gets hurt. Someone falls off a ladder or something happens, and next thing you know it, you're getting sued. Why did this happen? People don't even expect this when a company comes over. All they expect is the service to be performed and everything to be done to high safety standards. So one of the things you need to be sure of when you do call a window cleaning company is do they have high safety standards? A window cleaning company needs to have OSHA standards. They need to be safe on ladders. They need to be safe on any lifts that they might be using. They need to be safe with any poles that they might be using on the job. They need to have workers comp. It's so important that a company have workers comp. So if a worker does get hurt, they use a worker's comp insurance instead of suing your homeowner's insurance. As long as they are properly insured and they are complying with OSHA standards, you should be fine. You should be working with this highly safety approved company. So if you like what you've seen and you'd like to learn more, then please go to my website, jjwindowash.com. See you soon.